Hey, what's up? It's uh, Chavi again, and now I'm going to show you the glass uh, fleece system for the walls, which is uh, a fire retarding glass fleece, and uh, it says it is a uh, class zero fire rated, and uh, it hides and prevents cracks, and it is basically as a lining paper but uh, you can paint it over and uh, gives a very smooth and nice finish and uh, it can be applied with this uh, ready mixed uh, adhesive you have the tool for the smoothing on top of the roll and this uh, roll is uh, 50 square meters and it costs uh, um, just over 100 pounds it is about 100 pounds uh, plus VAT in the uh, UK together with the uh, adhesive um, Actually, I, I did a foam coating on the wall because of the mold, to prevent the mold. Uh, this is the outside wall of the building. And uh, I just uh, strip the wallpaper. I'm stripping the wallpaper. Actually, I'm, I'm doing the prep work. And uh, there you have the foam. You can, you can feel it. It is a, a soft uh, foam, very thin on the wall. Uh, and uh, gives uh, the feeling of warmth so it is much uh, warmer than up uh, up there on top of the rail here and uh, well thank you for watching uh, I will post another uh, video with a ready-made job and the processes which are involved so ac actually this is just a preparation well this is the tool which I'm doing the which I'm using it uh, for stripping the wallpaper it's very good even for the ceiling because uh, it is with vacuum. It has a vacuum compressor included, so you don't have to hold uh, the steamer. You can release it and it is uh, very useful because the hot water is not dropping on your hand and it's not burning you. Well, thanks for watching and uh, see you soon. Bye. Hello, I'm here again. Uh, I'll just show you another room where I already fitted the glass fleece on the walls and uh, the owner asked me to do just these uh, walls where it was a cobalt and it was uh, quite damaged the wall but normally it should be done all the walls of the of the room you can work around the boxes this this is a ventilation hole where uh, the fireplace it was previously and that's it thank you very much